Hello favorites. Welcome back to Favorites with Laura. So thank you for stopping by. We're going to do a Timu haul and I'm going to jump right into it. I have this bag that I talked about yesterday that I was going to get through. But since then, since then, I still have the one bag that was chewed on, which looks like this. And I got to turn it so you don't see my address, of course. But it's super heavy and I do have several things that might be um, taking up the bulk of this, but we'll see. That's one bag. And then I have another one just as big down there, which I'm exhausted already from looking around for something that I had put in a safe place. It took me forever to find it. <laughs> anyway, I wanted to quickly update you with this. Remember I hauled this, it's a little binder that holds your die cuts um, for crafting. And I bought the magnetics, uh, sheets to put in here to hold my pieces in place so they don't get tossed around and that's just like I only have a couple so I have a couple more and I have to go find those <laughs> I think they're in a box and I'll put those in here now I had mentioned like you know I really wanted magnetic sheets for every one of these slots right now I have 20 in it in here and that's about half of the sheets that are available to put them into and this is heavy with those magnetic sheets, so I probably I probably will not be adding more. Okay, so you know about Timu, right? We all do, right? But if you don't, just know if you're a new app user and you download the app, you can save some money using my code FAV70814, and that will save you 30% on your first purchase. And then after that first purchase, you get $100 gift coupons, uh, uh, it's multiple coupons that add up to $100 that you can use in your future purchases. And what else? You get 90 days to decide if you want to return something. If something's broken, not quite right, whatever, you have up to 90 days. And then you would just process that through your order. There's a little refund, return button. You click that and it will process and you'll pick out what item out of your order that you're going to return. And you just go through those prompts. And um, sometimes they want it back. Sometimes they just give you a credit. Um, it's totally up to, I don't know. I don't know. It's up to the, the Timu gods there that will um, decide what has to come back and what doesn't. So just follow through and you'll get your return or a refund. And what else? Oh, you get 30 days to do price adjustments. So anytime a seller or supplier changes their pricing, then within that 30 day window, since you've ordered, you can go into your order. If you have the price adjustment button, click that and it'll tell you. And um, it would automatically credit you back either to your original payment form or a credit to Timu. Everybody's different, but that's available to you too. So. Let's get started. So I, I think I've hauled one of these before. And this is a multiple outlet charging thing to your car. Okay, so I got a second one. And this has an LED light here for you to see. And then you can also daisy chain it. So you know what that means is like, you know, if you have other ones or you have an outlet that plugs into here, you could do it that way too. So pretty interesting. Or Oh, it's probably because something can be charged by this has that kind of plug to it so I don't know and on and off switch but I liked it because it had the four um, USB outlets as well as a plug-in outlet so you have something that you need in the car when you're traveling that is a great feature so hopefully that works I haven't tried it out yet I feel like I was going to update you on something else too It'll come to me. So thank you for finding me. Thank you for stopping by and watching today. We have a lot of different things from clothing. I have tons of shoes, so I might break those out and do a totally separate Timu haul for that. I want to get a lot recorded so that I can spend my time doing some crafting this weekend. Okay, so I got this cute little swimsuit and I'm gonna have prices up here. I'm not gonna speak the prices because that takes up time, but when I go through editing, I'll pop it up here and you'll see the pricing of this image at the time of publishing here, okay? So this is a cute little tankini that I got for my daughter and I thought it was super cute. Um, it says life is good on it. Super cute with the flowers. And here is the top. And I hope she'll like it. It has little, um, it's not like support in there, but it is a halter top type. 
and it looks like this and it has little ties down here and there you go and the back is like I said halter it has a lining um, swimsuit material super super cute I think she'll like this and the top is adjustable of course so there's that and I'm going to try not to say there's that every five seconds because we have a lot to get through. Um, so it's the weekend. It's going to be starting. I want to thank everybody who came over here and has started to subscribe and to watch the channel. And I want to appreciate everybody else who has been here and keeps coming back to watch. Um, I have a gaming chair to put together. So I will be recording my assembly of that chair and then we're going to review that okay so that's coming up I have some keto crate to share with you now these are bras that hauling it with me um, recommended to me and they have underwire a little bit more support than just the sports bras or some of the other bras that i bought on timu before and they were eight these i did have price 816 there's um five bras in here for eight dollars and 16 cents I actually have one on right now. I'm not going to model that, but wait a minute. I'm sorry, did I say five? No, it's three, it's three. Anyway, so I will show you the colors and show you how it looks. I'm so happy with them. They are super nice. They have the underwire here. Um, they have the white straps. They have four loops um, adjust adjustable loops here to loosen it, tighten it, whatever you need. I mean, these are like any of the name brand bras that are out there that you would get at a department store or online. Um, adjustable strap up here. This is a very great supporting bra. I would suggest, because I did not purchase this based on what I thought my size was, you measure your under the breast uh, measurement, you will measure that and then um, go from there. So when you look at the sizes, don't be surprised if it says like a higher size than your no normal size would be. But when you click on it, right under that, it'll give you the measurements in inches. And that's what you should actually go by. And that's what I went by, even though it killed me to pick the higher size because you know, we like to think we're smaller, but in those um, measurements that they show on Timu, it's not always like that. So I'm happy I did because they fit perfect and they're adjustable and I couldn't be happier with the bra. So I highly recommend this. Now these are some shorts that I have purchased. I think I got these around $8. Um, but these are actually softer than, I thought they, they have the same cut and style as the ones I was hauling that kind of have like a linen feel to them. These are actually softer and I thought they were really cute. I like the pockets. Man, these are gonna be great. Oh, I love them. I got them for my daughter. I think she's gonna like these. They might be a little bit big. 95% polyester, but still drawstring and I think it's a working drawstring. It is, it does have elastic and uh, it's elastic sewn in place. It's not sewn in place, so it could twist on you. I'm not going to guarantee it's not. But I like that it has a working draw strip in draw strip, drawstring in addition to the elastic and big wide pockets right here. Okay, so I'm not going to say it. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, then I saw. Smile to a Hurts, haul these, and I had to get some because I had never seen them before. Now, when you go, and I bought a two-set pack, and I did have the price for this one. For two of them, it was only $3.36, and what they are, I never, ever saw these before. Have you seen these before? They're for, like, working in the garden, but they have, like, little claws to them, and they also double as maybe a Halloween <laughs> costume for your hand but um I thought how great is that you're gonna be able to grip and they seem the only thing is you can't feel your fingers but I don't know stick it in the dirt that's awesome especially when you have nails and you don't want to get the dirt under the nails okay and so they're rubberized here so you have grip here it is like 
not rubberized here in the black section, but you get two pairs for $3.36. I look for the best deal. And I've also seen it, so when you're looking online on these, I'll have my links below like I always do, but be careful because some of them sell it just with the tips and that you could use your own gloves. I'm thinking those may not stay on if you put them on yourself um, as well as these being made to have them already on there. I don't know. I haven't tried these before. I never saw them before. Saw him haul them. Eric hauled them and I was, I, I they jumped right into my cart. <laughs> right into my cart okay then I got some water shoes they kept popping up in my feed and these were 1008 popping up into my feed I know you can get them elsewhere do different things wow those are pretty okay these look fun okay so they look like that lots of tread and when you go into the beach, sometimes you go into rocky beaches, and I just thought, how cool would these be? And they're made to dry really fast with the water to flow through them. And they have an adjustable strap here, which reminds me, I have a Fitville um, haul that's going to come up too. Not a haul, but a um, review. They are reached out to me again, so I'm excited to show you what I picked something new for the summer out of there. Um, let's see. So I'm going to just see how these feel on. Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay, so these fit perfect. What size did I get? I'm a seven and a half normally. And these are a 39, so that's what I went with. I don't know what that equals. That's usually what I go with, a 39 European size. And great deal. I like how the texture is on the bottom of them. I like how it has an adjustable strap. Okay, so that's that's pretty good. So, okay, so we got through that one pretty fast. And we are going to move on to my next bag here. I don't know which bag to go with because that one I think has a lot of shoes in it. Okay, let's... Here's the one that looks chewed up. Did I already hold this? Oh, I already held this one up. Ah. Okay. Okay, so pricing on these should be up here for everything I'm going to pull out of here. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm going to start with this. This, and I'm going to pop a picture up because I don't want to take it out of here only because we're going to put it in the travel trailer. And I, oh, well, maybe I can. Okay. But I know I got this for under $3. So this has been all over the feed. I know, um, hey, everybody. Not hey, everybody. Did she get it? I don't know. Um, I know that Eric did. And I saw it. It's on, it's on Timu from several different stores at different prices. So this was a lightning deal. I don't know if it's still going on, but I hauled yesterday the um, straps to tie it up to a tree. It's a hammock. And because I didn't know if this came with your straps or not, I didn't think it did. Most hammocks, I don't think they do. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I have my nails on, I can't. So this is like a fabric canvas type of material, and that's the same color um, scheme as the hammock. And I'll put a picture up here so you can see what it's supposed to look like, but it was under $3. So I am going to be excited to have this at the campsite this year. Yes. Now, this is a deal, and I think, okay, everybody, I gotta, I gotta put this down. It's. It's way too heavy. It's not going to sit on my table, which is very little. This is a pack of shorts, and I can't remember if this is the one for my husband or the, the son. Oh, it's the son. Okay, so medium. And dark gray, but it's a whole pack. I think we got several in this pack. And we're going to pull these out. Man, I hope he likes them. I got one, one pair, two... So it came with three, four pairs, five, wait, one, two, three, four, five. 
Okay, you're gonna see the price up here. It was an amazing deal. Now, these are like the wick free, wick away kind of pants, um, shorts for the summer. And I thought they were pretty cool. They're loose fitting, he likes that. He likes just the silky kind of feel so it just like flows and he doesn't have to worry about it. Um, they have zipper pockets so it's gonna hold whatever they put in. They're pretty deep. Um, they, they're just straight shorts. There's no lining. I mean, there's nothing in the, in the middle. Um, so that's the light gray. I hope he likes them. They kind of look big, <laughs> but, and they have working drawstrings in the middle right there. Um, there's a darker gray. There is a dark blue there and two pair of black pair. Okay. Same thing. All same style. What a great find. I thought these would be great because they can be dressed up or dressed out. My son doesn't care, but when we go away, I want him to have a couple of things that aren't like stained or have he spills everything, he'll paint, he'll do anything, he doesn't care, and I always have to have a couple of pieces at a good deal put aside so that it doesn't look like he's neglected when we're out amongst the people. If you know what I mean, he's a teenage boy, and it's, it's a challenge. It's a challenge. And I'm hoping that I'm just gonna pop these in his suitcase. He won't even know they're there. I mean, I might let him try on one pair of black ones since there's two of them. It does seem like it's fabric that's going to snag here and there, but I think for the deal, and if I can just get through the summer with some of these like this, I'd be happy. Okay, I'm just gonna pull out the next thing. Okay, these are, oh, so these are underwear that I saw. Tammy at Hauling It With Mima. And it's one, two, I'm gonna show you all these, okay. Got one, two, three, four, five. And I think I got these. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. <laughs> to me, they look like men's underwear a little bit, but they're with the outline, like a cartoon outline there. So that's that color. We have the lavender or the light pink there, um, a green. Uh, burgundy and the blue super cute super nice super soft let's see what they're made of oh they're tagless well that's another plus tagless I don't see hardly any seams oh on the side okay they're bikini and I don't know I think these are cotton they're 100% cotton, but I will confirm that and put that up on the screen for you. I love being able to do that for you because I know when I'm watching a haul, I kind of want to know what's going on. I want to know what it is, and I really appreciate that they have the links below. I thought somebody was coming in. Um, so that's helpful. What do we have here? Okay, so this is a, these are Razorback t-shirts for my daughter for the summer and I get the plane I mean we get other stuff but these are just like you know okay so she does layering and these are really thin so she can do that they're not as um they're very thin okay so I'm just gonna say that um if that's what you're looking for this is a great deal you get the white you get, and they, they kind of like flare out like a, um, let me see. On the picture, I thought they were more flared out like an A line and they kind of look like they go out. They're cut for a girl for sure. And yeah, so you can see, you put a couple layers on, they're gonna be super cute and they're very thin. So you get that color, this color, this color, this color and this color. How fun is that? She's gonna like these. There's three, six pair, six tops for layering, which is probably what? Two outfits, because <laughs> she'll layer several together. Okay, it's gonna pile up here, guys. This must be a clothing haul. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I think I got my husband some too. I, 
Yes, these are for him. So I bought him the same set of shorts in a different color setup. And we're going to see what colors we got for him. Same ones that I got my son. That's right. We were um, shopping in bed. <laughs> and I was asking him if he would wear them. And he thought they looked kind of cool. So one, two, he's no frills. Three, four, and five pair for him too. Red, gray, cobalt blue, navy blue, and black. Did we get two pairs of black on his too? No, we did not. Okay, so I hope he likes these. He's going to try these on today, I'm sure. I don't think we'll get him to model them, but it's been a while. He used to model. He's modeled close before in the early days of this channel. So we'll see. Hey, if you have a channel and you haven't signed up for the influencer program with Timu, click it. I'll have all the information below and you can do that too. Okay, so here's another pair of, I think, shorts for my son. Or is this a swimsuit? Kind of has that swimsuit fabric, so it's going to dry. Oh, in case of moisture. <laughs> Let's see. Is this a swimsuit? You can usually tell there's lining in there. No, okay. So he could definitely, like I could see him doing that. I kind of like how it looks on the side here. So same zipper kind of part um, pocket. It says inner sport or new sport, new sport. Um, it's totally fab, uh, polyester, 100%. So yeah, going to dry, I hope. Um, I don't know. He may not like these pair. They kind of feel a little bit funny. They feel, feel like a swimsuit, but I don't know if it's going to act like a swimsuit. Okay, so not sure if... Okay, so these are for my daughter. These were super cute. And there's one, two, three, four, five pairs of underwear. And... They have like the little tag here and their bikini or briefs probably is what they would call it. What's it say? It says, uh, Nishi. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it says, but they should be cotton too. I think there's a tag in here. 95% cotton, 5% spandex, but the crotch is all cotton too. So they have that. And the crotch there. So that's one, two, let's see. We have, here are my colors. Pretty colors. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. So everybody's going to have some fresh undies, shorts. It's the weekend. You know what that means for me? Even though I haven't really cooked that much this week because I was sick, it means my husband cooks this week. <laughs> he loves to cook. And he spoiled me when we started dating because I would come over to his house and he would always be cooking. So here's like the other pair of shorts in this color. Again, I got those for my daughter. I hope she likes them. Um, they're super soft. And did I see what these were? 95% polyester and 5% spandex. Same big pockets. They're same cut and style um, as the solid ones that I have bought from Timu, but mine are more linen feel to them. They're polyester too, but they feel more cottony linen. And these are more softer cotton, which is what the kids would like more anyway. Oh my gosh, more shorts for the fam. That's from, oh, so I bought the same set that I got for my husband, same shorts for my son. Another pack, five or six pair, I don't know. Same thing. So they must have had a sale on these shorts and I got them in every color for her. I just like the fabric, I don't know. I just like the way it looked. I hope she likes them, otherwise they'll be going back because that's a lot of shorts that you don't like. But what pretty colors, huh? Pretty, pretty colors. So I hope she likes those. I'm gonna have her try them on. I don't know. She does not like, she gets put out if I ask her to try on anything too soon. And I know when I was a kid and we got new clothes, which 
you know, it was a different age. So we were really, really excited. It's not like we were spoiled with new things every day. And um, I would I would want to model them. Okay, what are these? Are these tops? Mixed colors, large. So this must be for my son. Uh-oh. Um... 95% polyester, 5% elastine. Now, when I see the combination of polyester with elastine, I my experience has been it's been a softer type of polyester fabric, and so it does come across as feeling like cotton. So I did get him these tops, these t-shirts, because he just likes the plain t-shirts. So they do have a cottony feel to them. They do have a little stretch. And I got this pack. It has one two, oh my gosh, three, four, and five. Did I count right? <laughs> Sometimes I'm not sure I counted right. It seems like it's a lot more than that. So yeah, and I got those in large for him. So I think he's going to like them because they feel super soft. And I have found all cotton long sleeve winter t-shirts for him that he loves. And those were super soft. And I was kind of looking to find them in a short sleeve version, but I could not. Now these do have a tag in them. So, you know, I think the ones I bought that were cotton for the long sleeve ones this winter, they were tagless. And if it bothers you, you know what I mean? If it doesn't, then it's no problem. But these are very well made. They feel just like, I mean, that's a great deal. I'll, you know, the price, of course, is up on the screen. And you tell me what you think of these deals that I'm finding in these bulk packs. So when they are really not too worried about, you know, as long as this doesn't have a logo that is replicating a, you know, a name brand logo, they don't want to wear the fake stuff, but they won't mind wearing the stuff that doesn't have any logo or like that one that has the logo on the pocket new sport I don't think it's going to bother him but when it's on the shirt yeah if people can tell he won't wear it so I like finding the plain plain items here what's in this box uh oh you might have to I'm going to save that because I definitely have I went crazy with the shoes okay okay so we're going to hold off on that. Oh, okay. So Just Jen, if you haven't checked out her channel, check her out. Just Jen is always finding the best greenery. And I had to copy her. Yeah, I was influenced. I'm just looking at all the fun stuff in here. Okay. It's fun. It's fun. So she had hauled these. I don't know if it was these exactly because I went and looked at her. And I couldn't find the right deal that she had. But I think these are exactly the same from the same store. And I was able to get a pack of four for this price. And they look really good. Now you have to fluff them up. I like them because I have like candles, big, thick candles. And I thought that would be, I don't like them. So don't worry. But yeah, they're all, you just reshape them. And you get a whole pack of four of these. So you can double them up if you want to make it extra thick. Um, or are they different? No, they're, they're, they're all the same. So you get four of these in this pack. Thank you, Just Jen. Go check her out. I'll have her link below too so you can find her channel really easily. I've been happy with all the flowers on Timu. Everything I've bought. Now... It takes me hours to pick out what I want. So I do stare hard, long and hard at them. And if this is another pair of those shorts, I'm going to... Nope, it's not. Okay. Guess what this is. <laughs> it's not shorts. It's not shorts. Um, I'm put that down there. Oh, I'm, guess what I'm going to record right after this for another day my shoe haul because I am excited and I want to have those shoes available to me. Okay, so I also from T 
Tammy at Hollin' It with Mima showed these. I immediately asked her for the link and ordered them. Yeah, I found one, one, two, three, four, five, six. And I can't remember, so up on the screen when I look it up, these are sports bras. And I like them because they didn't have the razor back because I have several with the razor back and that's not how all my t-shirts are. So I wanted some sports bras that look like this. So they have the long piece down here. I can't wait to try these on and tell you later on how they fit, how well they worked. But um, they have the little inserts here. So looks like you could probably take them out if you didn't like them. But they're not adjustable, okay? So most sports bras aren't. So you probably, she did tell me to size down so it would be a little tighter. So I, I hope I did that because last time I didn't and I did not size down, but I went by my measurements, Tammy. So I'm gonna hope that this works for me. And you get this color, you get a dark gray, you get a light gray, they're all individually packed too. A black, a white, and of course a pink. So great find. I'm happy now. The real key will be when I try them on and update you later. Okay? So we're gonna take that out. Oh, and what am I wearing today? Well, of course I have my headband from Timu. Bought that last year. I have a white one too. It's like a dupe. And then this is my Talisa Solitaire. And then this is a um, tank mock neck bodysuit that I bought from Timu last year. Uh, earrings, I believe, are Timu. And then this little cover, thin cover um, jacket is from Maurice's. It's a little women's clothing store which I before Timu used to shop at all the time because they always have the best coupons and I like their clothing they fit well probably came from Timu too then I kept seeing this in my feed and I bit because it was on sale I don't even think this dress was like I don't even think it was five dollars but you'll see up here on the screen it's polyester it's exactly like I felt like it would look um And I saw pictures. People actually did reviews with pictures. There's no pockets. It is a short, like, A-line dress. She come down to just about my knees, I think. And it is a little polyester look to it. It had different colors. I just liked how this color looked. I don't know. I've never been one to like green, but lately I have been buying green because I don't really have that in my wardrobe. So I went by my measurements again. Now the stitching does kind of look wonky. I'm not gonna lie. Maybe that's why it was discounted. So maybe it's just a cover up to wear at home or something like that. Um, it seems stretchy. I, no pockets like I said. Cute dress, you know, just an everyday thing probably. This is, the bag a little lighter but you can tell that there's a lot more in here okay oh I'm excited about this okay I forgot about this so gosh I hope I got the right one this is a phone case I know I have a phone case I know that okay I have phone cases that I love too but this one's different okay this one is embossed with that design that medallion kind of design and it snaps and you can put your quick things in there, your card, your ID. Um, so all you have to do, oh, it's a magnetic closure. That's cool, so it stays shut. And I think, I'm not positive, does this have that RF, what's it called where it protects your phone, your cards from being, boy, that's pretty, it has a real leather like feel and look to it. Stitching around here, this is very finely made, I mean, yeah, this would be probably a lot more in the stores. So check this out. It's got a rubber grip in here. Um, I hope it fits my phone. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the right one. It says it is on there. 
so you'll be seeing me wear this one, use this phone shortly. Okay, what else? What else? Um, I don't remember even putting this in my bag, but I'm sure that I did. This is... Oh, yeah, I do. Okay, so I don't remember how much this is off the top of my head. But what I liked about it is you can watch... Oh, it's a what? See, it's all coming back to me. You know, when you get to this age, things go a little slower and it comes back to you eventually. But it's a rice washer or really anything that you need to wash off. You can pop in here, put it in there, fill it up with water. Um, it's got a screen right in here. And then you just pour it out the water and just keep rinsing out whatever you need to rinse out. That's cool. I like that. Um, that's so funny. They have the, they kind of look, I don't know what the symbols are. Huh. You, maybe you can see here. See right there? Kind of like a little house and a star and a number. Cool, right? Okay. So, I don't know. It must have been a lightning deal. Something that was made it worth my time to put in my basket. Or it could have been one of those last things where I was trying to get, okay, I don't even know why I got these. <laughs> I think I got these for my friend, to, for my daughter to share with her girlfriends. And they all have multiple holes in their earrings, in their ears. And I saw, I don't know if he hauled this set, Eric. He's a reseller. I'm not. And so I know why he got them, but the deal was outstanding. So I thought, well, if she can just share them with her girlfriends. So what they are is how many pairs do you have in here? Hmm... 108 pairs, but there are three pairs to each card of earring studs and all the different rhinestones. And if you were a reseller, if this wasn't all wonky and the box wasn't all crushed up, I mean, it would have a nice display. You pop that out and you could display it. But it is wonky. I mean, it is Timu. And my bag did look chewed up. And I'm going to have to search to see if anything's actually missing from this bag because it had holes all through it. But we still shop at Timu. So you have like, it almost looks like you could find, well, they don't have all the, all the, all the burst stones in here. But there's one, two, three, four, five, six different colors. So I'll hold that up close so you can see that. And she should be able to share some with her girlfriends. How fun would that be? And I could always pop some into giveaways as I do. Oh, by the way, speaking of that, oh my gosh. Uh, we're over 9,000. <laughs> over 9,000 subscribers. And I'm going to have to put together a giveaway for my 8,000 and my 9,000 because that's what I do here. So I'll probably have one giveaway that's going to have uh, multiple giveaways in them. And that'll be coming soon. So make sure you are subscribed and make sure that you have hit the bell so you're notified and you don't miss out when I do that video. Because I want to be able to thank you. And if you're not aware you're going to miss out. Okay. So this is a way for me to thank my subscribers by doing a big giveaway when um, I get that together. And then I'm currently still in that collab that ends tomorrow. So you have till tomorrow on the 4th to participate in that. And what it takes is to watch all eight channels videos, which are about 12 minutes average and um, go through and follow what they have requested. I do have a code word on mine. So, you know, just listen for that and put that in in a sentence and you're going to be golden. Okay. And then I'm going to draw following the fourth. Um, and then I'll make my announcement and I'll probably put a community post up also to make sure that whoever I choose has every chance in the world to make reach, reach out and make contact with me. Okay. So this is a tape dispenser that's handheld. So I thought I needed it. <laughs> I probably do. Okay. Don't judge. Here's my cat. Don't judge me. Okay. I know everybody's saying that now, but <sighs> that, that cat does look at you funny. Okay. So this 
has tape in it already it looks like but you get an extra roll with it it came in different colors it's called Eagle auto tape dispenser and I don't know I don't know if you have to hold it down but let's see let's see what happens here I have to feed it up okay I could read the directions let's see if we open it oh it's not even fed through yet okay so let's do that let's feed it through how do we do that I'm trying not to make faces when I'm trying to look at something. Okay, I'm not going to take forever to do this, but... And it's hard when you have nails because it doesn't... The nails don't act like yourself. I can't find the end. I mean, it has that... The color tape right there so you can know it's right around here, but... Oh, there it is. Okay, let's see if I can get it. If I can get it, I would love to show you this because I want to see how it works too. Oh, I'm getting it. There we go. Okay, now... Now, where is that going to come out? Right down there. Okay, so maybe if we do this. I'm just flying by the seat of my pants because I don't know how this goes, you guys. I've never seen one of these. And I've only seen the ones where it's a different type of handle. Let me see. Maybe if I fold that one. Now I'm getting tape all over my fingers. See? Okay, so I'm going to fold that down. So I can feed it through without it sticking on everything. Maybe you just have to feed it there. So see, it has like little rubber, little feeder grippers there. And let's see. I mean, it's gonna. It worked. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. So it spits out just as much as you need. So you just pull it. There's no cutting. It just spits out a pre-measured piece of tape. Can you see that here? Let me see if you can see it. It's pre-measured. Awesome. Okay. And it looks like it's going to take a regular size tape. Hmm. Where's my other tape dispenser here? So this is a regular size tape that I have. Same thing. Okay, guys. So you you should be able to use your regular tape to refill it. And to me, that's Dollar Tree. <laughs> okay, that's awesome. Okay, I like that. We got it to work. Cool. That's super cool. Okay, let's not lose the extra that came with it. Okay, moving on. Can somebody come and organize my house? Because I've gotten out of control. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Well, I think some of these are going to go in a giveaway. I can't even. They must have been on sale. Oh, and I wanted to try out. Okay. Don't worry. I'm coming back to you. I'm coming back to you. Okay. So... These nails, I think these are a shorter version of what Tammy had hauled. And they're really, really pretty. They're a shorter version. I don't know, but if my hair gets caught in them, they're no good for me. I don't like that. Then these were fun. And I'll put the prices up, of course. These have like a marbling look to them. And then this was fun. This is like more Easter vibes to it. It's like melted chocolate. I don't know which way they go. <laughs> um, I think these were all on sale and that's why I picked them. I love these. Okay, so these I could even recreate with my stamps. My um, stamping art plates. That is so cute. Those are my favorites so far. And then uh, I got these for kicks and giggles. I don't ever wear them this long. Can you imagine? <laughs> I know Tammy does. I know she wears them this long. I can't handle myself. Huh. Anyway, those are cute, huh? Cute, cute, cute. And then these were like, okay, so I did the math and it's less than Dollar Tree. So you get a hundred, a hundred of these Q-tips and I've seen other people like them. So I think, I think I ordered enough that added up to a hundred, um, not to a hundred. There's a hundred in each pack up to a dollar. So I think I got them for 27 cents or something like that. And there's probably more in here. And there are. Yeah, I, I ordered an, so that's like 400 cotton swabs. And they're the wooden sticks. So that's cool. 
Then I got some cording to make some earrings. So here's like my boho earrings that I did not make. I got these from Timu. But I thought, wow, I can do that. So you know how the boho earrings are. They have this like that. And so I got some gray cording to do that. I have one second. People are coming. Okay. Coloring is different. Okay. I got some like neutral color there, like a taupe. I have no room on this table left. A dark brown. Because they were so stinking cheap. And a black. So I got four rolls of that. How much is on a roll? 100 yards. That's going to last me a lifetime. I'm never going to use all the crafting materials I have. Just so you know, I know that. Okay? I know I have a lot of crafting items. I know that already. So. Okay. Hold on. I got to make room. I got to make room. We have no room up here. Okay, let's come back to that. We'll come back to that. What is this? Oh, okay. So these are some of those other new sport shorts for my son. He likes this color. And I like that color. So hopefully he'll like those shorts. Hopefully he will. Okay, it looks like my room exploded. There's so much stuff here. Okay, let's see. What do we have that's interesting? Okay, so who hauled this? Maybe it was Reviews with Sue. Okay, so I saw them and I thought, oh, yeah, I need those. She might have, I don't know if she got them from Timu. But this is a pack of, I think, five. We're going to find out. Maybe ten. I don't know. They look like rubber bands, but they're not. They kind of are, but they're for something else. One, two, three, four, five, six. So you get six of them in multicolors. What are they, you ask? Okay, well, I know the yellow ones go into my daughter's chair. So when we go on our beach little getaway, you put your towel over your chair and you put this on the back of the chair and it holds your towel from flying away in the wind, which always seems to happen when we're at the beach. So I got six of those. More than we need, but I thought they were a very awesome idea to have something like this. Okay. What's next? I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Hold on. Bear with me a second. I don't want to lose everything that I'm going to show you. i got to put that over there. Oh, good. They they hear a bird and they're gonna they're gonna bark some days. Okay, so we got them all out of there. Okay, so let me just put some other stuff back in this bag real quick because I have to go through and organize everything and put it away. But if I don't get it off this table, I'm gonna have no room to even talk to you anymore about any of this stuff. Okay, so we have, pay no attention. These are all for making jewelry, like earrings. And I just wanna make sure I don't forget anything to show you here, okay. So they had a ton and okay, so this is, I think the 20 inch silver tone. Um, no, it's 10 inch. Why is it 10 inch? That's too, too short. What are they talking about? No, that's like 16 inches and you get five of them and it's silver tone box chain to hang whatever pendants I make because I want to include a chain with any of my jewelry and I wanted to try out some of these different ones. Okay, so I think yesterday I showed you these that I was going to make earrings out of. So I got another set in here and then along with that I was able to, I also got the gold because they came in two different colors. And so that's that. I'm going to make earrings and stuff. And I did get some more die cuts. And these were like 39 cents if I recall. And that's why I chose them. Let me see. Yeah, they, they were just like a special deal. 
and they're really tiny. They're much tinier, but I thought that would make cute tags. 39 cents, I think. And then I don't really know why I have this one. <laughs> But that's a heavy duty piece of metal. That one's thicker than any of the other ones I've seen. They just like look like little flowers or snowflakes. Okay. Those. Then I saw, I can't remember who hauled this, so I'm sorry about that. Um, these are supposed to be like little mirror cleaners or glass cleaners. Like they don't expand or anything like that. I think it's more like a like a Mr. Clean sponge thing and it's supposed to like clean that way. Well, let's see. I have I happen to have a mirror with a bunch of fingerprints on them. I think you get them wet. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so I can't really tell you how that's going to work yet. I'm going to have to I'm going to have to do some research on that. I just dumped my mirror. Hopefully that didn't crack because we know what happens then. So I've got a two pack, two pack, pack. Okay, here's some more chain. This is ten. This is the ten pack. Let's see how long those are. About sixteen inches too, like the other ones. They do pretty good. This is the first one I've ever seen, kind of tangled, not too bad. And it's just a um, silver tone um, alloy. with an extender on each chain it looks like they're not tangled though i mean that's pretty amazing yeah so that's going to be about a 16 inch chain from my experience uh, looking at this so that was a reasonable deal and again i'm just trying out different ones because it's hard to tell like i don't know how big i want it i don't do, know the measurements in milliliters or whatever they're measuring those chains and how big the links are going to be. I don't ever know that. Oh, and I got these hearts. This one was uh, on a big deal too, a big sale. Okay, those are all crafting things and we're still moving on with the crafting. Oh, okay, so they had these beads, these stones, and I thought they were pretty to be able to put with some of my work. And yes, I got them in two sizes because they were so pretty on the picture that I had to do that. And lately YouTube has just been really difficult to upload. It's taken so long. So once I'm done here, I'm not going to crack into that other bag and I'm going to have to cut this one off. So I have the eight milliliter, millimeter, eight millimeter. And then I think these are six right next or four, something like that. So yeah, so I, I like how cold they feel. So they're real stone. I don't know what stone they're supposed to be, but um, I thought they would be a nice touch to some of the pieces I want to make. Okay. Eight millimeter, and this one doesn't tell you. Does Six. Oh, it is six. It doesn't look like it's only two. Then they had all these glass bits. Now I'm going to pop a picture up so you can really see what I'm seeing. And they had all these different colors and glass bits to hang and make dangling pieces from, like the little leaves here. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to show you that. If you can tell, that's a green leaf. And then they had different um, flower petals like that. And they're already pre-drilled, so you can string them along. And this one, did it have multiple colors? No, these are just the blue flower ones. Again, I think it'll be easier if I pop a picture and you can see what it looks like from the image. And then here's some hearts that are pre-drilled, different colors, multiple colors, heart glass beads. Those feel like glass, the last set. Let me see if these are 60 pieces in this bag. Okay. I mean, they feel like glass. They're probably resin though, because I think they would be a lot heavier if they were glass. It's little tiny hearts. I think it's easier to see in the bag. And so that's mixed. And then, oh, these are some more leaves with the tulip flowers. 
And then these are some butterflies. Now these look a little bit more plasticky and I probably would make like children's jewelry out of it, a bracelet for them. Then this are some teardrops. And then this one here, these have the red tulips, flowers with the green leaves. Because I had to have every color and then purple tulips with the leaves. I know they put the labels on everything, but I'll put the pictures up again. And then here's some little stars, which of course I was thinking of, but that's really a little plasticky. And then these are more like uh, you're going to hang them like this and the leaf and the flower goes around so the hole is in the center of them and I'll try to pop the picture up too. And then I found these dragonflies. I mean they make it so affordable you can definitely get different colors of everything that you want to want to play and experiment with. Dragonfly make earrings out of those. Um, oh here's another um, die that was on sale. They're a lot smaller so I mean really I guess for 30 some cents on these I kind of expect them. I thought they looked bigger in the picture. We used to say that a lot. Oh I thought this would be big. We don't say that anymore. That's so last year. We're so used to it. We've been desensitized to the size. Um, I don't even remember what this is supposed to be. Oh, it's a mouse. It's a mouse with the drum. But you can tell how tiny it is, okay? So, I mean, that would be really cute just to have that little image for your journaling. And then here's some more pink tulips, if you can even tell. My goodness. But you get the picture. That's my haul. Thank you for show showing up. Thank you for watching. So come back because I have all kinds of footwear here to share with you. All kinds of miscellaneous things with that. So... Yes, so don't forget, take a look at the playlist for the Timu Spring Fling collab that I'm part of with Mary Catherine Loves Cats who hosted it. There's eight channels involved in the collab. We're all doing a giveaway. So you have uh, one in eight different chances to have your name picked, okay? And we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Have a great start of your weekend. Bye. Mm -hmm.